Welcome to this demonstration of Addo's Disk Benchmark Tool for Mac OS. The Addo Disk Benchmark Tool is available for Mac and Windows operating systems. In this demonstration, we will go over what Addo Disk Benchmark is, as well as some of the parameters that can be set for testing. The Addo Disk Benchmark Tool helps users assess the performance of their storage devices. It will perform read and write I.O. to one or more target files. Since it accesses existing volumes, it may be used to benchmark network shares as well as direct attach and SAN storage. Test name will be the title of the test that will be run. It will be displayed in the speedometer or bar graph views. File size is the size of the test file that will be created. This should not exceed the available space in the target volume. Generally speaking, a larger file size will allow for more accurate results, but will increase benchmark initialization time. Write pattern is the data pattern written to the test file. SSDs that support compression may require a random pattern to obtain realistic results. Stop on error, when selected, will stop the test if an I.O. error occurs. Otherwise, the test will continue to run and errors will be recorded in the disk table in the main application window. Q-depth is the number of outstanding I.O.s per test device. Higher Q-depths tend to improve performance by saturating the storage infrastructure. However, some storage systems will perform better with a lower Q-depth. Here you can select how many streams of data per disk you would like to test. There are two options to determine the behavior of the benchmark test, snapshot and continuous. Snapshot allows selection of a wide range of I.O. sizes, which will be tested individually. This provides a thorough assessment of how the storage performs under various I.O. workflows. Continuous runs I.O. continuously using only a single I.O. size until the test is manually stopped. This is a good way to demonstrate performance and stability over a long period of time. The Add Disk button will open the File Browser dialog. Navigate to and select the directory to benchmark. Note that several target directories may be added. In order to remove a target directory from the test, select it in the disk table and press the delete key. The disk table displays current data for the test in progress for each target directory. Bandwidth, IOs, and errors are displayed for both read and write IO. In snapshot mode, there are two drop down boxes to select the IO size range for the test. When the test is started, it will begin by using the size selected in the Start drop-down and will proceed to the next size option after a few seconds. This behavior will continue until the end size selection is reached. Snapshot mode features a bar graph output that displays the performance for each I.O. size in the test range. This is the best way to view which I.O. sizes perform better with a given type of storage. Click the bar graph button to view the graphical output. Hovering over a bar in the graph will display the numerical result. In continuous mode, a single I.O. size must be selected. The mixed I.O. checkbox is provided to set a read-write I.O. ratio for the test. To set this ratio, click and drag the slider towards the desired end of the scale. Continuous mode features a speedometer style graphical output. Click the speedometer button to view the graphical output. The gauges will update in real time to show the current performance of the test in progress. All graphs offer a drop down box to select the unit of measurement for the output. The default setting is megabytes per second. All listed options are measures of bandwidth except for the IOs per second option. IOs per second is somewhat different in that it measures how many transfers occur per second regardless of transfer size. This is important because some applications may stream many small IOs per second rather than fewer large IOs per second. Test configurations and results may be saved for later use. There are two different application menu options to save data. Save Configuration and Save Configuration and Results. 
Save Configuration saves the test configuration that is defined by the controls in the main window. The file extension is DBC. Save Configuration and Results saves the configuration for the test that was previously run, the test results, and also the configuration defined by the controls in the main window. The file extension is DBR. Thank you for watching this overview of Addo's Disk Benchmark Tool.